Good morning, modern steaders. We're having nice freezing rain today. Can you hear that? So we have a perfect project for a day like today. We're gonna be making our concrete countertop for our desk for upstairs. We have the form all laid out. If you haven't seen the video for that, I'll put a link to that video right here. But I have it on the ground and I just wanted to make sure it's pretty level. It doesn't have to be perfectly level, but we don't want it at a huge slope and then having the concrete flow to one side or another. So I'm happy with that. Now we need to start mixing the concrete. For concrete, we're going to be using the Quickcrete countertop mix that we special ordered from Lowe's. This stuff works really well. We used it on our kitchen island countertop last year. We used a concrete calculator and it says we need three bags of concrete, but to be on the safe side, I like to order an extra one because it takes about two weeks to get it. What we're going to be using today is a couple of dust masks, a quart size container, some heavy duty gloves, a couple of trowels, and then we're going to be needing an orbital sander. We got a hoe for mixing, container with water, and we got a concrete cement trough.
adding rebar to it to give it more strength. Are you just gonna start off with more this time? No. This is the worst pop. You're better off mixing a little bit of water at it. Now we just gotta hope it's not too dry and we can get our names in it. Oh, 
I think it'll be well. perfect. Go ahead, Livies. You can be the first one to write their name in it. Perfect. And then write Lumna. Oh, you're writing your whole name. Look no, at you. I my first and my middle. Oh. She already knows what she was putting in there. Oh. And now the worst part is we gotta wait seven days before we can take that out of the form to see what it looks like. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you should cover out before he gets in it. Thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. We'll see you right back here tomorrow. At Love the Acres, a guide to modern home settings, self-sufficiency, and freedom. Bye. Bye.